Big news guys, TradingView has now come out with footprint charts, which you can use right in TradingView itself. So I myself am a Mac user and also I'm trading order flow these days and I've wanted to use footprint charts, but there hasn't been many good platform options for me as an Apple user, but now there is. So it's built into the platform. Um, in this video, I'll show you how to set up the footprint charts. It looks just like this. Uh, works seamlessly within TradingView, nice and easy to use. And I found it very helpful in my own trading. So I'll run you through how to set this up. First of all, this assumes that you already have a TradingView account. You can make a free TradingView account, of course. And what you're going to need to do, guys, first of all, is make sure you have the premium plan, at least the premium plan. Okay, so it's $59.95 a month. That will give you access to the footprint charts and all these fancy new tools that have just come out with TradingView. So $59.95 a month, select annually or monthly option. TradingView is always running discounts at all times. So keep an eye out for those. Or you can also use my link in the description, which gives you $15 off your first month as well. So that link is in the description and pinned in the comments below. Get your little saving on that, but you need the premium plan, okay, to be able to use footprint charts on TradingView. Most footprint platforms you'll find will run you about the same price as well. So make sure, first of all, you've got this plan, premium plan. And now let's jump over to the TradingView and I'll show you how to set up the footprint chart. There is standard trading. Trading view candlestick charts as per usual. What you're going to want to do is in the top left corner here, next to the time frame, got 30 seconds, my time frame. Then next to that, the little candlestick icon, click that. Scroll down, click on volume footprint. Once you've clicked that, chart will refresh. Zoom in, and there you go. You've got the volume footprint chart on screen, ready to go. Again, it's a tool that I use in my trading every single day now. Very, very helpful tool. One of the most powerful order flow tools. Um, here's the settings I have for my footprint chart. Everyone's a little bit different. I've got all standard settings apart from this. I don't have the point of control marked out. It's not something I personally use on the footprint. Um, and I also have the imbalance set to 600% and stack levels at four. So that should be the only differences from my chart to yours. I'll go through a video next week. I'll be putting out a video on how to read footprint charts, how to use them in order flow trading and scalping, how I personally use them. So that is coming next week, guys. In the meantime, this is how you set them up. Um, and if you don't want to wait till next week to learn how to use the footprint chart, if you haven't already learned it, in the description, I'll also link to Axia Futures. They have a three-part video series on YouTube. Best one, in my opinion, to learn how to read footprint charts. Very helpful information from those guys and um, helped me to understand them as well. So check that out. I'll put that in the description if you can't wait for my video next week. So that's how you set it up, guys. Nice and simple. Again, if you want to get that $15 off, my link is in the comments as well and in the description. $15 off your monthly plan from the first month for a little bit of savings for you. And there you have it, guys. I think it's honestly well overdue. I used to love the TradingView platform when I just traded candlesticks, but since moving over to Orderflow, I've really needed a tool like this. And TradingView was lacking in it. Now they're not. They've caught up. They're on the ball now with the order flow tools. They've got a couple of other order flow tools that they've added to the platform as well, such as Delta, Cumulative Delta, and some other good volume tools, which I'll talk about at another time. But this video, guys, hope you found that short, sweet, and helpful. Make sure you thumbs up the video, subscribe, and comment down below if there's any more order flow tutorials you want to see, order flow explanations, anything like that. But there is a weekly order flow series that is ongoing that I'll be doing every Wednesday. So keep an eye out for that, guys. Otherwise, I will catch you guys in the next video. Take care.